is not bad. That means both of you who are supposed to compete there together, uh, that's because both of you are kind of closely, closely related in skill. Hubby's pretty good. And you're pretty good. So that, that was the reason. And the winner will move on to like winners round three. So you know how it, you know how it goes. Okay, so we're just waiting here. Cerulean has arrived and looks like we got our, our opponents here. They're going to get things started. Oh, we got the hydrates and the posture check. All right, you know what? I'm not going to lie. I was kind of slacking on my posture. I was kind of slacking. So, you know what? Let me correct myself. Thank you all very much. Let's go. Chaos versus Cerulean. And we're going to be going off here onto PS2. I have to say I'm a bit surprised at this pick. A lot of times, you know, uh, Cerulean opted for some of the different stages. But PS2 is always the go-to for so many competitors. You know they love it. They love this stage, man. They always coming in here. Like I keep saying every week, you know, we're called straight out of Smashville. But Smashville, I'm sorry, homie. I think we're cheating on you, man. We're all about that PS2 now. We're going to see that nice little forward tilt pressure to come out from Cerulean, who's rocking the Joker for today. This is definitely a first. Trying to find a way. I love the cross-ups coming in there. Unfortunately, couldn't get the grab. And you see here Chaos trying to go at it. And this match is very close here, toe-to-toe -to -toe between these two. Cerulean's going off there. Fortune couldn't find that. And reading way too ahead, but definitely had that forward smash read. If it was just held on for a slightly bit longer, that definitely would have been a stop. There comes a dash tag here to apply some more pressure. And the two going at it, and there we go. There we go from Sir Ruling. Gonna connect with the forward smash right here to take away the first off. You know, our send comes out. It, it, it's just never nice, man. It ain't fun. It ain't fun whatsoever. Big brother coming in there. You know, trying to bully you for your lunch money, taking it away. Now, here it comes from Cerulean, trying to go with there. I mean, just applying as much pressure here, you know, poking in there, getting that extra credit as much as possible. The only thing that uh, we got to see from Joker is, yes, the damage uh, is the damage per second is really good when Arsene is not out. And he's trying to capitalize off of that. But, you know, Joker, not that heavy. And that power dunk almost taking it away. And Cerulean is going to get back onto the stage right here. And there comes a nice little get-up attack to get back into it. Chaos, though. Missing with that dash attack. Looking to try to find a way to finish it up. All it's going to take is that one down tilt and that one jab. And you got to watch out for it. Unfortunately, though, Chaos got just a little bit too hungry there. Looking to find a way to get a raw Buster Wolf. Oh, we got we, we to talk about those nice little two strings. But what in the world just happened right here? Damn. What just happened? Unfortunately for Cerulean, it's going to go down there. It's a bit of a SD, unfortunate. And I love the patience there. You know what? Just kind of be pretty much holding on to it. But I love the save jump to come out there from Chaos. Showing themselves to be a nice little Terry veteran. Got back onto the stage, but only to be welcomed by a forward smash. Ah, I'm sorry about that. It's going to hurt for sure. Nice little strings to come in here. Yo, Cerulean showing off this Joker. Yo, where did this Joker come from, though? Where did this Joker come from? The Tomahawk grab into the forward air. Still continuing on once again. Going all the way. Yo, Cerulean. Yo, yo, who's Me Gunner? Me Gunner who? Me Gunner who? Still at their second stock at 20%. Just ate a dash attack right there. Almost got dunked though. That would have been a very scary situation. Cerulean would definitely would have been out of that. All right, this time around, gonna recover properly. Looking for that downer and was expecting here to tech into that forward smash. It ain't gonna happen. Our send is out. All it's gonna take is one big hit, and that's gonna be it with the reflector here. Keep the chaos there off onto the stage, trying to find a way to here to end this stock. Good parry into the dash. I couldn't find it this time though. There comes Go on deck. Luckily, we'll actually survive it. I mean, it's not often you know you're gonna see your opponents there survive such a devastating move. Chaos relying here on this goal, knowing this is going to be the key to victories. All he's got to find a way is to end this stock and possibly take it away there in the last one. All right, getting back on there. Cerulean, oh, barely making it back onto the stage. And that was a very scary option to go super deep for it. Power dunk, not going to do it just yet. And Arsene is out yet again. This ain't looking too good right now, and unfortunately, Chaos is going to be jumping into that backer here from Arsene. You know for sure that move already hits hard enough, and if you start to get, you know, if the Arsene is out, backer is going to wax you for sure. And you see that power dunk not taking that stock away. You know for sure, man, that Chaos definitely felt a, a little bit, a little bit hurt there. Definitely felt a little bit hurt. And there was that nail in the coffin here to end game one. You see Cerulean is in the lead now. 
I have to say, I really, really like what I'm seeing here from uh, Cerulean's Joker. Looking super clean. Remember that Cerulean is a uh, is mostly known for his Me Gunner and um, Pikachu. But this is a nice, this is a nice pace. I, I like it. I like it. I gotta respect it. What we got? Oh, is that is that the notorious Lex deal here showing up in the chat? Welcome, welcome. That is RPG's leader. Welcome, welcome. All right, there we go. We're gonna get started here into game two. Remember, this is winner's round two. We do have a round three match here coming up. There it goes. Let's get it. Let's see what adjustments can be made here for uh, for Chaos. Now, remember, you know, Chaos de definitely did show a lot of strengths there in the first game. But once it really started kind of popping off with all these strings, I think Chaos kind of just, you know, was in shambles a little bit. That pressure was just a little bit too much. There comes a drag down up into a follow-up grab. And so really was going for it all. There comes once again here, keeping Chaos off onto the stage. Looking to find a way to two frame that upbeat. Remember, Terry's recovery, man, it never latches onto the ledge. It is a very scary recovery because it's very easy to gain. A lot of times they go super low for it. And that's going to be unfortunate here for Cerulean. Looking to find a way to end that buffered air dodge after the dunk. That's going to be the great stuff here to come out. Chaos finding themselves. You know, it, 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 it's uh, definitely a breakthrough. Needed that, man. Needed that. Sometimes you just got to take those, dude. It don't matter how you got that stock. You just take it away. All right, Chaos. Unfortunately, this is what we were talking about. You need to make sure that you recover super low. It will never latch on. And that was a very easy pickings here for Cerulean. Chaos, though, still having that slight percentage lead. But with Arsen out, like I was just about to say, one of these characters, once they get that one hit in, there comes that devastating string. There comes the power dunk here to return the favor at 57%. Chaos, though, trying to find a way to here to continue it on. But unfortunately, running right there into that neutral B. And there comes the dash attack once more. I love the use of the dash attack here from Chaos, who's been looking to try to cover some landings there. And has actually succeeded in a lot of those those hits all right jumping into that instead going for the gentleman instead and uh and you know we're usually going to see a power dunk follow up but keeping off the stage right there but this time around once again still going for it looking to maybe possibly conserve the power dunk to possibly use it as a finisher Remember that your moves could still, if you use them too often, that could be the potential there. There it comes once more, keeping them off at 118%. Unfortunately, that damage trying to uh, just tally up a little bit. Chaos, definitely after that first stock, getting that uh, big break. Going to be able to steer, take the lead with this pressure. I love the down tilt into the grab mix-up instead of trying to follow through with a Buster Wolf. But finally, Cerulean will find their way to get back onto the stage. That was a pretty significant 70% damage conversion off of the stage. All right, trying to throw him off. Not going to do it just yet. That's 183%. This time, though, we're going to see Chaos take a bit of a risk coming off there. Boom, out of here. Buster Wolf, though, not going to break shield, not going to do anything. 128% with go on deck. This is a very dangerous match. You know for sure, even though their final saw. Oh, I love the Dragon up there. Unfortunately, couldn't follow through. And there you go here at Chaos popping off, getting that nice little 48%. Unfortunately, he's going to jump straight into that reflector there. Keeping them off onto the stage, and Cerulean gonna clean up the stock. We have ourselves one stock apiece for both of these players there in game two. I have to say, reflecting the power wave away. Uh, okay, that's a bit of a surprise. Not often I see that. Dash attack is gonna catch Cerulean though. Definitely falling apart here in game two. Now, Cerulean though, in his defense, did have a very, very strong start there in, in the first stock, and then from there on has been pretty, pretty much trying to play catch up. Chaos, though, has come, done such a wonderful job of maintaining that lead. Not falling apart. Continuing just, you know, going ahead there. Getting those chips in. Getting those damages in. And patiently waiting here for their finisher. You saw it there in the last stock when he was going for just, the, you know, the gentleman's instead of trying to finish with the power dunks. I was hoping to f try to find a way to save that for the, uh, you know, stock finisher. Couldn't happen just yet. This time around, though, you see he has not utilized any of his moves. Power Dunk is still on deck. We still have a B there. Oh, reflected away here. Chaos, though, is going to make it back onto the stage very cleanly. Good stuff. Good awareness. And that up B is going to do it. We are going to game three. Great stuff here from Chaos. Bringing us here to game three. Some pretty nice stuff here to come out. Oh, we got Lanny in the chat. What's up, Lanny? Doing mod things there, fixing up Griola's uh, command. Now Griola won't be joining today. Today on the mic. Help to see today though. 
Uh, but Griola was actually on the mic on Friday. We had to smash Intercontinental on Friday. Man, my voice is still a little lost from Friday. <laughs> but you know what? It, it was a fun tournament, honestly. It was so fun. I, I, I had a blast. I'm sure everyone who watched had a blast. Griola had a blast. So today, our boy Griola has got to rest up a little bit. Griola also commentated yesterday, by the way. I think yesterday was uh, Gaming for a Cure. I really hope that you all joined that. Game 3 is upon us. Let me just go ahead here and check the bracket and make sure our next competitors aren't going to go off on us. All right, game three. Who do you think got this? Who do you think got this? Let me know in the chat. We're going to go to Final Destination, I have to say. Quite a bit of a surprise, though. I know a lot of Jokers don't mind this, too. But, you know, none of the drag down up air strings that you got there in the platform. You saw what Cerulean was going off there in game in game one on PS2. Those drag down up airs there on the right platform was able to extend that, a lot of damage there. Extending the, those combos. Now we're going to see here. Terry, don't mind these flat stages whatsoever. And you see how close so far this match has been. This time, though, Chaos is on the run. Taking that early lead, but Cerulean will make it back onto the stage. No problem there. Comes a down throw, though, and you know that's going to connect for free. Cerulean looking to find a way to finish this off. And unfortunately, was not close enough to the ledge here to hit with that reflector. But that would have spelled so much trouble for Chaos. Cerulean taking her time and is going to be rewarded. That forward smash is going to take away the first stock. Oh, we got we got a, we got a spicy little take there in the in the chat. Someone looking here for chaos to take the W. So far, though, I mean, you know what? Doing a really good job, but that's going to be a scary situation. Power dunk off the stage with Cerulean there in mid, having all control of the stage. There comes a nice strings there, opting for the forward tilt instead of a follow up of the uh, neutral air. <clears throat> neutral are going to connect here from chaos, who has control here, of neutral. Couldn't find a way here to convert that to anything more just yet. Definitely has to find a way here to end this stock first. It's going to be way too problematic here to let you really live too long. But Power Dunk will be doing a trick for him. So I just wanted to see the bracket for a second. There it comes here, Cerulean though. Unfortunately losing this lead just a little bit. It's starting to dwindle down as Chaos continues to get those chips in. But Cerulean though was going for the hardest read. And that's going to be some nice stuff here for Chaos to take advantage of that situation. Man, was that a close call. That forward smash was charged for a century. You were not going to live that at all. Cerulean though, going to try to take advantage of this opportunity with our send out. Definitely be able to hit them with that neutral B here. Keep them away at the ledge. Trying to find a dash attack to finish it up. And man, Cerulean is not afraid here to use that forward smash. Unfortunately, after taking too many hits, Arsene is going to go flying out of here. He's going to connect there with a the very nice little back here. here. And unfortunately, couldn't find a successful hit off the stage. But still continuing on and has the situation at hand one more time. Cerulean, though, still couldn't connect with that back here to clean things up. And Chaos slowly but surely coming in. And unfortunately, trying to go ahead here, finish it up with that monstrous geyser. Couldn't hit with it. Cerulean taking advantage of that miss and back here to clean things up. But you saw there, Chaos almost taking away the stocks. Cerulean, though, has the advantage here and will have the opportunity to try to get as much as a extra credit as possible here onto the last stock. You know for sure, once you get down to your final stock, you don't want to leave it to chance. As the percentage goes up, your probability of winning just goes higher and higher. And really needs to find that opportunity here. Trying to find a way to get that down throw. Couldn't find it though. Chaos not making it easy to get grabbed. And that falling neutral there here from Chaos, keeping Cerulean off onto the stage. Can he find a way to here? Power dunk. Not connecting this one well, though. That's going to be it. We got ourselves here. One stock apiece here for both of these competitors. Let's get it. Winner's round two. Yo, that's already two sets here on stream going to game three. Love to see it. Love to see it. Good down here to come out. Continue once more. You see here Cerulean keep the chaos there off onto the stage. Charge it for it because unfortunately, like we mentioned so many times, the downfall here for chaos will be that he could not snap onto that ledge. Cerulean will be moving on, but man, that was a run for his money.
That was an awesome set. I hope you all really enjoy that. Yo, we got Tempo here. That's, uh, oh, sorry, that's not Tempo. That's Null. Null is going to be next on stream, actually. Definitely going to be looking forward to that. Oof. Oof. Nice and calculated, boy. That's unfortunately the pain here, but you see that that whiff there cost them in the second stock. It was so close. I wonder, you know, it, it's just one of those what ifs. If he was able to connect with that power guys, or would he have won it? Game three, super close. Both sets going to game three. We've definitely been spoiled here so far. Oof. Good stuff there. So really though, playing super, super well. All right, so that means our next match here. Let's go take a look one more time. It is going to be Null versus Fusion. I mean, I'm looking forward to this as well. Fusion actually being one of our streamers, by the way. So make sure if Fusion's in the chat, you know, give him a follow. Give him a nice little follow. He helps us quite a lot here. He's covered some crew battles here on AG Esports. You know, probably some events as well. There you go. There's Fusion. Give him a follow. Streams a lot of open, uh, open arenas, viewer battles. Make sure to get in there, and we're going to see him find there on, you know, we're going to see him on stream here at SOS. Let's get it. Yo, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. I'm looking forward to that for sure. So, how's everybody? Great to 